guys so welcome back today I am doing a review on gloss effects cosmetics they are a newer company that um, I've been in contact with to do a review and I'm finally getting around to doing the review I've been gone for so long well not from my channel but I've been kind of MIA for like the last week since I was in Vegas if you have not seen my vlog channel Click right there. Um, so I'm finally getting around to do this. I got these uh, items a few weeks ago, but I really wanted to kind of test them out, play with them a little bit, so I can show you guys how these items are. So, first off, I was sent six awesome products. So, I have three of their eyeshadows, and I have three lipsticks so I'm going to show you guys how these items are so the eyeshadows they are about five dollars a piece which is awesome and the first color I got was yellow magic and it is really pretty bright yellow it is a lot more uh, sheer on the skin Hopefully you can see that. I'm going to try to build up the color. It's a lot sheer on the skin than it is in the thing, but if you use a primer, then you shouldn't have any problems with it. I have Flushy, which is a metallic-y bright red, which is the most pigmented one out of the bunch and my favorite. There is the red, really shimmery and pretty, and it has like a, um, I want to say like a pinky, reddy, duo, shimmery thingy to it, so I really like that. And then I got this one in Glamstar, which is like a pink, purple, duochrome shadow. I'm liking it, so there's the pink one. These eyeshadows are really, really glittery. They go on a little bit sheer, but like I said, if you use a um, base, it'll definitely stick a lot better, especially if you use a sticky base um, or a white base. They will stick a lot better. I got three of their lippy stuffs, um, two of the matte lipsticks, and one of the HD Color Pops. Now the matte lipsticks normally come in the tube form, but since these are samples, these are just like the in the little five gram jars, and the HD Color Pops come in the jar. So the first one is an HD Color Pop, and it is matte, and this says Electric Violet. This is the least pigmented lip product. Um, ooh, it's very dry now. Um, it, it is very dry, but it's really pretty. I'm going to do a swatch there. It's very dry now. Like, when I first got them, they weren't that dry. So, I don't know. Like, I tried to keep them nice and tight. But... They all have a peppermint smell and taste to them, so I really like that. And I'll do a lippy thingy. That's the first coat. Um, I found that I needed at least six coats to have like a full opaque finish. Um, I have photos on my blog again of how it looks when it's fully opaque. Classic nude matte lipstick. And this is the... And this is the most pigmented one that I have. I only needed like two um, coats. Um, it's that's one coat, and then that's it on the skin. It's really pretty. It says that they're matte, but it does have some sheen to it, so I really do like that. And as you can tell, it's pretty pigmented. And I, this is my favorite one out of the bunch. The red one is in Crimson Wine. Now I had a little bit of trouble with this one. Um, I'm not sure if maybe it was just I got a bad one or something, but you can, maybe you can see it's kind of gritty and I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it's like really gritty on the lips. Um, it's kind of unstarred out now pretty much. Um, but 
it just it feels really pretty and like if you spend some time and like you know blend it out like really 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 well then it will like blend out but then by then the color is gone but um it is like a really nice like fitting look kind of to it so I really like that um I really like the color when I swashed it but it's just let me see if I can get it but like now they're like really gritty I don't know why they're well, I mean, now they're really dry. I don't know why they're really dry, but there's, like, one coat. So it's pretty pretty pigmented. But this one, I just have a problem with the grittiness to it. I'm not sure if maybe I just got a bad batch or whatever. So um, hopefully that's just the case. Um, but, like, you'll see in the, the HD photo, you'll see, like, some of the, like, grittiness in there. So, well, I really do like the products. The eyeshadows are super pretty. They're my favorite. Um, I do like the lip products. They are pretty dry now, and I've only used it once, so that's kind of disappointing. Um, the matte lipsticks that come in the tube, they are originally $7.50, but right now they are on sale for like 3 to $4, which is awesome. They have a lot of bright colors, fun colors, nude colors. They have some blues, purples, blacks, and I was definitely eyeing those earlier. Um, and the shadows are $5. The HD color pops are between $450 $475, so about $5. So that's awesome. Um, they also have a lot of other items. They have lip scrubs, they have clothing and merchandise, and eyeshadow primers, and press pressed pigments, and they have phone cases and all that kind of stuff. So they have a wide range of things. All shipping is free from them all shipping is free and like I said you know some of the items are on sale right now so you can definitely check them out I'll have all their links below where you can check them out um, the website Instagram Facebook all that kind of stuff but I really do like the products um, the lips were kind of a miss for me um, but I really do like the eyeshadows and I'll definitely be using them in the future I'm not sure about the lip stuff though. That's like the only bummer is the lip stuff and I'm kind of sad about that. But um, maybe I can like, I don't know, they're like dried out now and I only used it once before. So, and I try to keep the lid on tight like with lip stuff so I'm not quite sure. But um, yeah, I really do like the company. They have some really cool stuff. Um, and I also have, you know, the, the lip scrubs and stuff like that. So definitely check them out if you like what you saw. Definitely um, check out their website. Um, I kind of want to try the blue and the black and the purple lipsticks. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I know it's not the most positive, but um, the eyeshadow is really great. And I really like them. Um, I might try some other products from them. I'm not sure yet. Um, but definitely get the eyeshadows. <laughs> So, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you to Gloss Effects Cosmetics. Um, it was so much fun working with you guys. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to all of you later. Peace.